Now, previously known as the Super UHD, NanoCell is a new technology. The next step, available in three different sizes, the LG NanoCell range makes your favorite television programming as vivid as real life. Now, we have Brian Smith, the co-owner of BandwidthBlog.com in studio to give us more insights. Welcome to The Loft, Brian. Thanks very much. Thanks for having me. Now, I've been truly enjoying all the features of this NanoCell TV. They are super remarkable. But what I think is so outstanding that most people overlook is the design of television. And of course, LG has come through making sure that this TV fits in any space, any lounge, and any room. Don't you agree? Absolutely. I recall growing up that TVs used to be these massive black boxes that you would have in your With lounge. The bums. And you'd have your cabinet <laughs> to hide it up. But nowadays, we have uh, at least lounges where we can put these beautiful works of art that are our TV screens around. Mm -hmm. And I think what really makes the NanoCell range interesting is that it actually accommodates something that LG is called nano bezels. So what I mean by that, bezels are the very small side strips you might have traditionally seen on older TVs. Mm -hmm. And you might have noticed over the past couple of years, these have been getting smaller and smaller. Mm -hmm. However, in this range, the bezels are incredibly small. And that doesn't actually mean that you're getting less TV. Because manufacturers such as LG are able to produce smaller and smaller bezels mm -hmm. these days, it means it's actually more real estate for the screen in question. So not only do you get a great design, but you actually get more screen real estate to enjoy. Absolutely. That sounds so good to me because we definitely do appreciate the full aspects and the full spectrum of what LG has brought to the table here with these nano cells. And another incredible feature that I absolutely enjoy is just the AI technology that they've built into these TVs, making life so convenient, so easy. I mean, you can do absolutely anything basically with these TVs. What's your favorite feature? So there are numbers. So if we look at at least on the level that you might not interact with day to day, but definitely mm. makes life easier, these TVs come equipped with a really high-end processor that essentially is a quad-core processor, which is the equivalent to what you might get in many smartphones these days. Mm. It means things run that much more intuitively and speedily on the device itself. Mm. And that means that there are a number of artificial intelligence features at play here, which are really exciting. So for one, there's AI picture and AI sound, which can actually adjust the picture and sound to suit whichever piece of content, be it a mm. television series or feature film that you're watching on the go. So it means you're always getting the best viewing experience possible. Mm. There is, of course, also perhaps what is my ultimately my favorite feature is voice recognition technology. Ah, yes. And this means that you can actually ask your television questions all the way from asking it to recommend uh, all the way from a recipe to the weather this weekend. And we can actually try it out right now. Okay, let's go for it. I'm, I really enjoy this. What's the weather in Cape Town this weekend? That is so easy, so quick. We can already see it's thinking, it's pending, mm. trying to get the answer. And there we go. Looks a bit chilly. Okay. So definitely, if you're in Cape Town, do pack a jersey this weekend. And take and your TV a, with you. And take your TV along with you. Why not whilst we add it? And you know, this TV is just great for everything. I think for myself, I really appreciate a TV that has put everything into perspective, like the sound on these devices. I mean, there's no need to spend additional money on speakers or any of that. This TV comes with the best of the best in sound. Absolutely. So what people often find when they go out and purchase a thinner TV these days is that it's the excuse of uh, form over function. Mm -hmm. What I mean by that is when you purchase a smaller TV, many manufacturers don't actually install uh, high-grade sound systems and what you end up with is really tinny sound that you might have to go out and buy yet another speaker to couple to it. What's really interesting with the NanoCell range is that not only do they actually accommodate really large speakers themselves, so mm -hmm. the sound is always quite pristine, they actually accommodate different software features that optimize sound, uh, sound yeah. over time. So I mentioned AI sound earlier, but that's just the beginning in that we also have Dolby Atmos on board. That's maybe the technology that you're more familiar with with if yeah. you've been to a movie cinema, what essentially this allows in layman's terms is that if you're sitting anywhere in a room, let's say you don't have to be facing the TV head on, mm -hmm. you'll still be offered the same rich sound experience as you would if you were sitting in front of it and that it's omnidirectional. No, look, I'm right here for it. I love that surround <laughs> sound element and I want to feel like I'm in the film that I'm watching. But lastly, I want to find out from you, Brian, what is NanoCell? A lot of our viewers are not familiar with the jargon and the terminology and what makes this perfect for viewing pleasure? I actually really like the name, to be honest and this is yeah. entirely a personal opinion because there are so many different terms on the market. For example, we have HD, which I think most people will know is mm -hmm. high definition and perhaps is more the standard for televisions these days. We also have UHD, which is ultra high definition, which is essentially what some people might call 4K is the next standard of high definition. Mm. Super UHD, which is what NanoCell used to be called, it's now been rebranded, is essentially the next step in this technology. And it couples together a tech called HDR, which is high dynamic range, mm. which in layman's terms blends together really staggering highlights so bright surfaces on video and then low lights, so shadows. And rolling these together, you get a really rich picture that comes mm. quite close now to what we'll see in real life. 
Wow, absolutely taking the director and making him in our living room and absolutely. experiencing everything that he's brought to life. Thank you so much, Brian, Thank for coming through and dropping these jewels of knowledge. Now NanoCell allows LG to deliver more immersive, color accurate and rich viewing experiences. Previously known as the Super UHD, LG's NanoCell range of TVs use the latest technology to deliver next generation viewing experience, leaving older LCD technologies in the dust.